The breathtaking Ko'olau mountain range is filled with towering monstrous peaks and valleys that lend itself to capturing the clouds and as a result, the pure Hawaiian rain. In 1965 and 1968, people were killed and many houses were flooded and destroyed after a massive flood in the Kaneohe area known as Keapuka resulted because of that rain. Now, as a result, a dam was constructed across the Komo'oali'i stream to prevent future floodwaters from impacting the local community. The U.S. Army Corps of Engineers started construction on the dam in 1976, and the gate officially closed in 1980. This lake, as a result, is 32 acres and can be as deep as 10 feet. During flood conditions, the reservoir can take on 10 times the amount of water and rise to 57 feet and potentially 152 acres. The dam, which became a reservoir and then became a featured lake located within Ho'omaluhia Botanical Gardens, is stunning. It's also accessible via two gravel pathways from the garden's main office location and nearby parking lot. As you make your way to the lakeside, you'll find dozens of botanical plants, interesting flowers, and beautiful trees. Within the waters, you'll find a variety of fish, including tilapia, grass carp, and smallmouth bass. In the past, you could fish in the lake on weekends, and you could bring your own poles and toss bread or lettuce into the lake to lure the fish. Now the fish are eager to eat, and also birds and ducks will make their way to greet you too. This is a very popular and picturesque stop for sightseers, families, couples, and of course, picture taking. Swimming, wading, or boating in the water is not permitted. The slogan of the garden is to make a place of peace and tranquility. Here you'll find great sense of beauty, peace, and nature to reflect on and embrace. On a hot day, wearing a hat and sunscreen is essential. And on an overcast day, you'll want to wear insect repellent and bring an umbrella or poncho as this region does frequently shower with rain. 